Hi, I'm Peter with Leslie Swimming Pool Supplies, and this video will show you how to use a water testing kit. During the swim season, we suggest you test your water at least two times per week. Test kits use reagents to react with a sample of your pool water to give you a reading on your pool's pH, total alkalinity, and sanitizer, like chlorine or bromine. We recommend the DPD Deluxe Test Kit from Taylor. It's the perfect test kit for people who want to test their water at home. Before you collect your water sample, let your pool pump run for at least one hour. Then rinse the water sample bottle and testing vial with pool water. Try to take your sample from 12 to 18 inches below the surface of the water for a more precise measurement. When adding reagents to your water sample, hold the reagent bottle vertical to the test vial to ensure uniform drop size and get the most accurate test readings. To measure your pool water's pH, fill the larger side of the test vial to the top line. Then add five drops of reagent R4. Place the cap on the test vial and gently invert to mix the sample. Compare the color of the test sample to the color guide on the test vial. Your pool's pH should be between 7.4 and 7.6. Next, you'll want to measure the chlorine in the water. Fill the smaller side of the test vial to the top line and add five drops of reagent R1 and five drops of reagent R2 to the test sample. Place the cap on the test vial and gently invert to mix the sample. Again, compare the color of the test sample to the color guide on the test vial. Your chlorine reading should be between one and three parts per million. Finally, you should test your pool's total alkalinity. Rinse the large test vial with pool water and then fill the vial to the middle line, 25 milliliters. Add two drops of reagent R7 and then five drops of reagent R8. Swirl the sample to mix. The test solution should turn green. Now slowly add reagent R9 one drop at a time, swirling the mixture and keeping count as you go. Stop adding drops when the test solution changes from green to red. The ideal range for most pools on total alkalinity is between 80 and 120 parts per million. Be sure to always follow label instructions on the test kit and add the reagents to the water slowly. Water tests should be completed before you add any chemicals to your pool. Also, pool chemicals can take up to a day to have their full effect. When you're not using the test kit, store it in a cool, dry place to help keep the equipment and reagents in good condition. And pay attention to the product's expiration date. In addition to testing your water at home, you should bring in a sample to one of our stores every two weeks for a free test and analysis. If you have any other questions about water testing kits, call or visit your local Leslie store. For more videos and pool care tips, visit our website.